The testament of the soul Master Shoin left us is back in our hands. You should give it a read. Master Shoin's last words, the one he entrusted you with, I think he hoped that even if his body should perish, his spirit would remain forever in his homeland. Everything we stand for began with Master Shoin. You might find reading his testament useful for reflecting on all that's happened. Eventually, I'll have a manuscript made so his words can reach even more people. The power of a message relies on it being conveyed, after all. What do you need? See you later! Ah, so you have come. Now, it is time I told you the truth. Before we can go further, I'm afraid there is something I must yet ask of you. Would you hear me out? Ah, I understand. You feel pressed for time. My sincere apologies. I'll return to my chambers for now. Please come back. I'll be waiting. So, the issue at hand. I gather you are wondering why I betrayed Lord E. I must admit. He and I, we... He is a very important person to me. In fact, this hairpin is a gift from Lord E. But things are very different now. So much has changed, including my Lord and me. The man I once knew is now the Red Demon. And the truth is, that the role he has taken on torments him. Witnessing the recent purge opened my eyes. I now know that he must be stopped. And who else can do it but me? It is as if all these years by his side have led to this moment. I let Mrs. Fumi escape, though it may yet cost me my life. 
That was the right thing to do. Yes, I am sure of it. But now, I am suddenly terrified. I can't shake the feeling that something horrible is about to happen. What do you think I should do? Perhaps you're right. I suppose there is nothing to do but trust them. I'm feeling much better now. I must apologize for letting my emotions get the better of me. Will you join the Satsuma uprising, I wonder? I know a back street out of sight of the Shogunate. I will show you. I only wish there was more I could do for you. Let me know when you're ready to go. Shall we make our way to the Satsuma Villa in Edo? Yes, together. So you decided to join us. The Blue Demon's forces are marching on Princess Atsuko. It seems there is dissent in the Shogun's ranks. If they take custody of the princess, the Satsuma clan will become hostages. You're the one who brought Fumi back. You have my gratitude. Now we no longer have our hands tied. Leave this to us. You should get somewhere safe. Please, take care of yourself. I'll be waiting. Now to support the Satsuma. Are you ready?
when we work together, we've nothing to fear. Rest assured, I'll give it my all. Find the Satsuko before the enemy does.
appreciate it. Early of winter. Worth something. men are heading for that guest house. That's where the princess must be. 
Come on. Excellent work. <laughs> Don't rush. Take your time. Is that all? I wonder how you use it. Is that all? Thanks for your patronage.
So we meet again. But what can you do? thought the stray cat would wander in. Still, you did well. You have my thanks. <laughs> Out of the way. My lady, we will soon have dealt with the vermin in the grounds. I thank you. It seems all is going according to plan. I'm afraid I must bring something to your attention. What did you say? Live on. Together, we will continue his legacy. Thank you once again for your efforts. It pains me, but now we can do little more than wait. I will seclude myself in my inner chambers. You have no need to fear for me. Even the chief minister would not dare come for me there. With my stepfather now gone, the Satsuma clan will be shaken to its core. Its future depends on you and Saigo. But we lack experience. And our master is gone. You know Psycho better than anyone. Do you not? Compensate for each other's weaknesses. And secure the clan's future. Yes, my lady. I thank you. Now, what did you say your name was? Then you're astray with a sense of humor, it seems. Well, 
Princess Sato. Aren't they odd? I look forward to speaking with you. When things calm down. Until next time. Please forgive me, my lord. I did not foresee the stubbornness of the princess. You have been taking matters into your own hands, it seems. But at least the princess has been subdued for now. Fine work, but you are relieved of your duties for now. Go. Rest. Yes, sir. What is it? I'm grateful. Understood. Be seeing you. What can I do for you? Thank you. All right. If you'll excuse me. What do you want? I'm a happy man. Now? Sure. Not a problem. I was just thinking I've had my fear of idling about in gambling tents. And uh, I wasn't in the mood for the pleasure district either. Good thing you came along, because I feel like a good conversation. Kusaka often leaves to practice his swordsmanship or the like, and gets utterly consumed by it. But I need to break up the monotony, keep things varied. Even in battle, I'm there wishing I could noodle the shamisen. Why don't you give it a go? Fighting isn't everything. We'll have more to talk about when you understand the finer things. <laughs> you are missing the point. Listening is totally different from praying. Don't worry about praying well. You will understand in due course if you try. And with stuff like this, you can learn the theory. But that won't communicate the joy you're playing. Don't overthink it. Just go with your gut and let your fingers work. That'll lead you in the right direction. The arts of combat and performance have much in common. You will understand once you try. If you like to learn, I'll be glad to teach you. Even if it's just a once. I would love to hear what kind of melody you make.
You've heard about Tucker's death, I trust. <laughs> I just... Can't stop thinking about it. Ever since we met in Yokohama, she's done so much for us. And we had some fun in the Pleasure District, didn't we? But she was never just a regular geisha, was she? <sighs> she took an extraordinary risk when she helped Fumi escape. She knew the likely consequences, but still she did the right thing. <sighs> she may have looked like a flower, <laughs> but she stung like a bee. If I'm going to do anything for Japan's future, I need to show the same commitment she did. Kenzo is already working on a new plan. But I need some time to get things straight in my head. Why don't you pay a visit to Taka's grave? It's right here, in Saihoji Temple. Here to pay your respects at Tucker's grave? Someone's done it up recently. Perhaps her relatives. When she turned up here with Fumi, I knew I'd found a steadfast comrade. There was something about her. I could never fully let my guard down around her. Her death is a tragedy. But part of me is almost relieved. Sorry, I don't mean to speak ill of the dead. If she hadn't been mixed up with us, perhaps she'd still be alive. I'll go and pay a visit myself later. Whoever she truly was, we owe her our lives. Hey. So you heard. Let us pray for her. You may cast blame later. This is not the place. Taka, I am afraid I cannot stay long. I must fulfill my duty.
Indeed I do. And that's not all. Under the Shogun, I will muster the power of the nobility and imperial court, strengthen our military, and negotiate a new treaty. A fairer one that shall protect our people and our wealth. Are you lonely, dearest Taka? Well, hold on. I won't be long. And when I join you, I shall give you the most exquisite hairpin you have ever seen. It seems Gensui's latest plan is coming together. We're just waiting for everyone to get here. Ever since Gensui read Master Shoin's last words, he's been all fired up about forging a new Japan. In fact, I'm pretty sure he's gearing up to attack the Red Demon's men head on. What do you think? Can you handle the fight? Good. Then let's do this, together! We've made arrangements to that end. That's true. Hmm. You always pop up at just the right moment, don't you? <sighs> Roma, look at this. Every last one of them is here to help us strike down the Red Demon. Hmm, truly an impressive sight. Firstly, I would like to thank you all for joining us. We all come from different domains, places with separate customs, different loyalties, in fact, some of our clans once opposed each other long ago. Yet we have cast aside our differences and come together. Truly a testament to Master Shoin. We must strike in the name of all who have been oppressed. Let us not forget the pain of Master Shoin and the countless others who have suffered. We will bring this darkness to an end and deliver divine retribution to the Red Demon! I am allowed as many guards as the Shogunate provides. Do you expect the Chief Minister to flout the rules?
so good.
my fate to die at the hand of a long veiled edge. I could not help if I pledged to protect. March 1860, the Red Demon was assassinated outside the Sakurada Gate of Edo Castle. They were saying the trade talks are being suspended. And you mm. just believed them, did you? You try arguing with them. I don't welcome the taste <laughs> of steel, personally. Mm. I... Wait, uh. who are you? In the wake of this incident, Shogunate authority plummeted as the rebellious samurai grew emboldened. The influence of the United States, which Yi had done so much to promote, waned, leaving the door open for the British to take their place. After their triumph at the Sakurada Gate, Kusaka and his allies plot the next step in their quest to expel the foreigners. Let those beasts be. 